Hi everyone, welcome to Extending Machine Learning Algorithms by Pratap Dengeti, a video course by Pact Publishing. I'm Doug Stevens, and I'll be the voiceover artist for this course. Pratap Dengeti develops machine learning and deep learning solutions for structured, image, and text data at TCS Analytics and Insights Innovation Lab in Bangalore. He has acquired a lot of experience in both analytics and data science. He received his master's degree from IIT Bombay in its industrial engineering and operations research program. He is an artificial intelligence enthusiast. When not working, he likes to read about next-gen technologies and innovative methodologies. Let's take a look at what we've got in store. Section 1. Decision Tree, Bagging, and Random Forest focuses on the various tree-based machine learning models used by industry practitioners, including decision trees, bagging, random forest with the HR attrition example in both languages Python and R. Section 2, Boosting an Ensemble of Ensembles, shows Add a Boost classifier and Gradient Booster classifier. In the second part of the section, we will see Ensemble of Ensembles with different types of classifiers and bootstrap samples. Section 3, K Nearest Neighbors and Naive Bays, illustrates simple methods of machine learning. K nearest neighbors is explained using breast cancer data. The naive Bayes model is explained with a message classification example using various NLP preprocessing techniques. Section 4, Support Vector Machines, describes the various functionalities involved in support vector machines and the usage of kernels. Section 5, Recommendation Engines, shows us how to find similar movies based on similar users, which is based on the user-user similarity matrix. In the second part, recommendations are made based on the movie-movies similarity matrix, in which similar movies are extracted using cosine similarity. And finally, the collaborative filtering technique that considers both users and movies to determine recommendations is applied, which is utilized alternating the least squares methodology. These would be the prerequisites of the course. Take a good look. This course takes you through a number of practical solutions covering a wide range of topics you need to know about statistics for machine learning. So, what are we waiting for? Let's begin this journey.